Peace and blessings, everyone. This is a video concerning Michael Vick and his legal issues that are taking place. For those of you who are not familiar or who don't keep up with sports, Michael Vick is a quarterback for the Atlanta Fal Falcons. And uh, recently he has been federally indicted for dogfighting, which of course is against the law. Um, and really more so I want to speak to those who are picketing and protesting and judging Michael Vick. Anytime someone judges someone else, anytime someone takes a position of moral authority, of being in the right, I always wonder about that person themselves, that person who is pointing a finger. That person who's saying, I'm right, you're wrong, so I'm better than you. Those people who are protesting, I wonder, when they left protesting, when they left being out there picketing, wanting the NFL to suspend Michael Vick and to even fire Michael Vick to, not, to no longer allow him to play in the NFL, to take away his livelihood, I wonder, when they, le when they left, did they go get a hamburger to eat? That morning before they arrived, did they have bacon with their breakfast? And of course, I, I am bringing up each of those because in each of those situations, we're talking about the, the murdering and slaughtering of an animal for their benefit. We kill animals every day for our own sustenance. So is that better than what Michael Vick is doing? In each, in each instant situation, it is a human saying they have the right to do something to an animal. That they are higher in the food chain. They, that they had a moral right, they had authority to determine determine the life of an animal. I believe that all testing, experimentation, the, the, the seeking out and searching for drugs for the human benefits to, to get rid of diseases, all these tests should be on humans themselves. Don't do it on animals. Don't subject them to the, to the torture, to the pain, to the suffering, to the, to the drawbacks from these drugs. And I believe that if you want to find a cure for a disease, then you take that person who has that disease and you experiment on them. Subject them to all the stuff that we do to animals every day which is for the betterment of humans. Do it to the humans. If you want to love animals, then love all animals. If you want to protect the animal, then protect all animals. You know, some will say, well, dogs are different because they're domesticated. It's no different, it's all the same. It's an animal, it's all the same. It's us saying that well we can treat an animal one animal a certain way and another one not because we like this other animal. It's okay to slaughter a pig because a pig is nasty. You know, kill it, let's eat it. Even though they say pigs are as smart as dogs, or intelligent animals. Be thorough in your judgment, meaning judge yourself. I love animals. But am I going to judge Michael Vick for what he did? No, I'm not. I can't say whether he was right or wrong. He broke the law. But I can't say whether or not the law should be in place. They're saying it's wrong to dogfight. 
it's wrong to put dogs in a situation where they're going to kill each other. But then we go out and kill animals, all other animals, all the time. All the time. When somebody decided to take the position of moral authority and say, well, it's right over in this situation, but wrong in this one. Make it consistent. Be thorough. Judge not, lest ye be judged. God bless. Peace and love.